Your scare today at a St. Mary's County High School. The threat was called into Great Mills High School, forcing police to search every classroom and every locker. Parents rushed to the school to check on their children. Suzanne Kennedy live from the school with what happened today. Suzanne. Allison, two of the three high schools here in St. Mary's County received threats today. The most significant one taking place here at Great Mill High School. The lockdown started just minutes into the school day. I just can't wait to get my son out there and, and into my arms. It was prompted by a 911 call saying there was an armed student inside Great Mills High School prepared to start shooting at 10 o'clock. Parents rushed to the scene hoping their kids were okay. They should have metal detectors down here or something because people are crazy. Like people are saying, people are crazy. They're losing their mind. They'll do anything to somebody's children. These photos from inside the school show students during the lockdown gathered in the hallways, deputies in the classroom. Others watch the sheriff's response through classroom windows. Authorities searched around the outside of the school, then quickly moved inside. We systematically went classroom to classroom, and now we're in the process of taking care of searching each individual locker. We have to physically open every single locker, just do a visual search to make sure that there are no weapons uh, in, in the building. After more than four hours, some students were released to their parents, telling of this unusual day at school. They wanted everybody to get behind the desks and get down and uh, don't make no noise. We couldn't, um, we couldn't move at all. We didn't know anything until we got on the internet and found out that it was a threat. We don't know if it was a bomb threat or somebody trying to shoot the school. That caller did give his name, but as of yet, no arrests have been made. Reporting live in St. Mary's County, Maryland, Suzanne Kennedy, ABC 7 News. Thank you, Suzanne. Meanwhile, Alexandria police say reports of a man with a gun outside Maury Elementary School Tuesday were false. Just after the noon hour, several students reported seeing a man pointing a long gun at them through a chain fence. The school was locked down, and after an investigation, police say the reports were unfounded. Authorities say they always take reports of this nature seriously and then respond accordingly.